what's up guys the race here welcoming you all back into another video and in today's video we are having a comparison between two bluetooth speakers on one side i have got w king x10 and on the other side we have anchor sound core motion boom now both speakers are fantastic in their own judgment for sure now this comparison is completely based on the audio output performance of both bluetooth speakers we are within this video first to start with we're going to have a look into the features offered by both bluetooth speakers following with their audio output performance so let's not waste too much of time and straight away look into the features offered by all new W King X10, which come with the built in DSP technology, fixed equalizer settings like indoor and outdoors, waterproof rating, which is IP6, decent enough to be honest with you, and a deep bass feature. I also come with the three passive radiators, two from side to side and one on the back. Come with a battery life of 15,000 mAh, which will last you up to. 45 hours no problem whatsoever and from the side of power output speaker can deliver up to 70 watt peaking up to 90 watt of power that's huge for sure with the frequency response covering to the high range of 40 kilohertz so the low bases are also covered as well due to having so many passive radiators around it the base is something you're going to feel around your body for indoors as well as for outdoors too now let's talk about the anchor sound core motion boom well honestly speaking this speaker does not need a lot of uh, saying about it it is a pretty decent bluetooth speaker give you a lot of features as well come with the frequency response of up to 40 kilohertz and that has only been possible due to the titanium line drivers on it but don't forget it x10 also got the two titanium line drivers as well along with the tweeters too now from the side of features motion boom come with a very fantastic feature and highly recommended to use by most of the viewers who already bought this speaker is a customization of equalizer settings using the sound core app and i have done it too the settings you can see on your screen are which i have used in this video come with the ipx7 waterproof rating 24 hours of play time, USB-C connectivity and also have a USB-A output port to charge up your smartphone devices. Does not have a support for 3.5mm auxiliary port and honestly speaking it's more or less like classed as a Bluetooth speaker. Whereas if I look into these kind of feature on X10 you have got them all covered. You have a 3.5mm auxiliary port micro SD card slot which can take music up to 128 gigabytes USB A output 4 to charge up your smartphone devices USB C to charge in which is a fast charge as well so if you got a fast charger you can charge this speaker in no time whatsoever well i have done a full detailed video review on both of these bluetooth speakers link for them are available in the video description and also where you can buy them as well i have covered in very much brief detail on both of these speakers. now it's time for going ahead with the audio output performance which will be based on indoor and outdoor playing at different different volume ranges too sound core motion boom is set on a customized setting which i like the most obviously it can differ from your taste but I have seen it working better on this kind of a setting work great for me so they are set on that one whereas W King is set on by default on indoor and outdoor mode depend where I am indoor mode is like a bit more bassier solid and outdoor is more or less like open and perfect so let's not waste too much of time and straight away jump into the audio output performance
well here we are in the end of this video and honestly speaking i am a bit puzzled with the results which i am hearing from both of these speakers they are almost the same actually yes i know it's a shocking to be honest with you when you customize your sound core motion boom to your needs the way you want it it is perfect bluetooth speaker i have always admitted it the reason i did not change it myself because i wanted to use the default settings because everybody will be using the same thing too but when you customize it you can get a little bit more out of your sound core for sure no doubt whatsoever but but let me tell you one more thing about the x10 actually here by w king it is a solid bluetooth speaker the output is phenomenal all right if you put it inside in a room in like indoors the bass which it delivers is fantastic it's a solid it's a proper feel bass actually that's why i say that x10 is the winner for sure out of this competition but i have to admit it that motion boom also gave him a proper fight actually now obviously there is a price difference between both bluetooth speaker but if you can afford it a little bit putting extra money i would always go with the w king for sure a perfect companion for indoors and outdoors beach and pool parties no doubt whatsoever battery life is solid as well so is its output I have done a full detailed video review where I connected the speaker with the my television to show you that how it can work as a sound bar as well worked great for me. Well, motion boom, I can't do the same thing on that because it does not have auxiliary port. Now, that would be completely all guys. I would recommend both Bluetooth speaker. Both are winner for sure. Now, that would be all guys. Thank you again for watching this video. Shall see you soon into another one. Bye for now.